Hi, thank you for joining me today. We're reading through A Course in Miracles to Daily Lessons, and today we are on Lesson 348. I have no cause for anger or for fear, for you surround me, and in every need that I perceive, your grace suffices me. Father, let me remember you are here and I am not alone. Surrounding me in is everlasting love. I have no cause for anything except the perfect peace and joy I share with you. What need have I for anger or for fear? Surrounding me is perfect safety. Can I be afraid when your eternal promise goes with me? Surrounding me is perfect sinlessness. What can I fear when you created me in holiness as perfect as your own? God suffices us in everything that he would have us do, and only that we choose to be our will as well as his. Let me read this again. I have no cause for anger or for fear, for you surround me, and in every need that I perceive, your grace suffices me. Father, let me remember you are here and I am not alone. Surrounding me is everlasting love. I have no cause for anything except the perfect peace and joy I share with you. What need have I for anger or for fear? Surrounding me is perfect safety. Can I be afraid when your eternal promise goes with me? Surrounding me is perfect sinlessness. What can I fear when you created me in holiness as perfect as your own? God's grace suffices us in everything that he would have us do, and only that we choose to be our will as well as his. I'm going to read this last two sentences again because they are a little difficult. God's grace suffices us in everything that he would have us do, and only that we choose to be our will as well as his. This is uh, an interesting uh, lesson. So if we can come to the place where we understand that not only are we divinity in form, but as this quote that I shared earlier in a, uh, earlier this week in a different reading, uh, and I'm looking for it here now. There in the, this is a part of it. This is from Ramesh Balsakar. In the functioning of manifestation, there is no one that does anything. Nothing happens unless it is the will of the source, the will of God. And so with this lesson, I bring this up because basically what we need to understand is that we are here so that divinity can express through us and have the experience of life through us. That's what's happening here. And so this is, this is why this lesson says, I have no cause for anger or for fear, for you surround me. It isn't just that it surrounds you, it is you. And in every need that I perceive, your grace suffices me. So if we were to move through life, always having faith that God is in charge and that we are God's instrument, we wouldn't have fear and we wouldn't have anger. That's the point of this lesson, I believe. So if you'd like to talk about this more, 
uh, you can message me, 907-351-3003. Uh, you can uh, get a hold of me through wherever you found this recording or video, Facebook, YouTube, SoundCloud, or you can message me through my websites, lindalamp.com, lindalamp.shop. So until tomorrow for the next daily lesson, namaste and much love.